Without those three leading scorers, or three of the four top scorers, Clemson is down nearly half of their offense, a third of their rebounding, and 60% of their threes. And uh, the three-point shot outside is hit. I don't doubt it. She certainly is, uh, you know, and she could have been that high last year. There's those post moves. She just <laughs> threw that one up. I don't know if she had her face looking at the basket, <laughs> but she brings it in for her sixth point, and it's 11-4. If you don't know the area that well, that's in Central. That's about five miles from Little John, so I'm talking right in the neighborhood. Boy drives into traffic and uses the glass. She's feeling it right now, Jim. Get excited. That's right. It's kind of like in football when, you when you're when you open and you, you drop a pass because you're thinking about what you're going to do after you catch it. Odd for three and drills it from the outside. That's the Tigers' second three-pointer of the game. In and out, oh, man, that thing got about halfway down and spun out. That was a great skip pass by Matty Odd as well. Kunain inside and gets the bucket and gets fouled by the smaller Matty Odd who was trying to cover her. With about four or five minutes to go. And she started fouling early. Now this was back in the old Little John where the Tiger Paw was about half the size of this one. Amy made two from the Tiger Paw. Debbie Ryan was just shaking her head. Whoa. Long three though by Diamond Johnson to answer at the other end. Perez swinging it around. Bobby kicks it out. Johnson the three. And it goes. Driving into the basket, another kick for a wide open three pointer and it's drilled outside by Boyd. Chains back to Elmore, 10 on the shot clock. Elmore looking for help. Elmore can shoot it. Sanifer kicks it, three point try. Ott drills it, Matty Ott. Without a doubt, that'll give Coach uh, Moore something to gripe about. <laughs> <laughs> Gaines will drive around with the closing seconds and gets the bucket to end this one with NC State picking up victory number 13.